Stimulus talks, Melissa, have broken for this evening. House Speaker Nancy Pelosi telling reporters that she's confident that there will be a light at the end of the tun tunnel. She just doesn't know how long that tunnel is. Well, for its part, the Trump administration says that if the two sides still remain too far apart and don't reach a deal by this Friday, their imposed deadline, that President Trump will be seeking executive action to protect uh, renters against evictions and to reinstate uh, that $600 unemployment boost uh, to workers who have been laid off. The chief of staff, Mark Meadows, just made those comments in an interview with CNN and says that they will be meeting again on Thursday evening to see if they can reach a deal. Melissa? Kayla, thank you. Kayla Tausche. Uh, it sounds like the administration really wants to make sure that there is a continuity in terms of these enhanced benefits, Karen, which would be a, a good thing for the markets, I would think. I think so. I'm a little bit confused. I thought one of the sticking points for <laughs> McConnell was not $600, right. something much less. So is it, was she saying that Trump's threatening they're going to give him $600 if we don't have a deal by Friday? That, that was sort of... How I heard it, which doesn't, I mean, uh, okay, that's, a, that's, that's an interesting way to negotiate. I would, there will be a deal, though, I think is the bottom line. Both sides need it too much. And, and they, on this one thing, or maybe the couple things, maybe China as well, but on this, they, there, there will be bipartisan support. They have to have a deal. It doesn't do any good. I know that it seems like the Democrats have a little bit of an upper hand right now, but they have to get a deal done. And the market has priced in a deal. Yeah. Kayla, I think you you heard Karen's comment. You're still you're still there, actually. So this, I mean, this is framed as sort yes. of just an extension of the status quo until Congress can can decide. Correct. That's my expectation, Melissa. The White House actually, uh, as of last week, backed a short-term extension of that $600 benefit for another week so that they could have that not lapse as they were uh, in talks to get a deal. My understanding is this would be a short-term extension of that as they tried to broker uh, a compromise somewhere in the middle on that. But Meadows was not specific about the dollar figure, mm -hmm. but the White House's position has been that it would support the $600 on a short-term basis and something like $400 on a compromise basis for longer.